Okay, I have this pot, potted plant. It's about three foot tall. It's a cedar. And I, I made that pot. It's about two foot by one foot. And I'm going to pot this in to here. So, my cameraman hole. Okay. Now, I'm going to tip it on its side. And it isn't coming out. So I'm going to go get my machete. I don't know where my machete is. Um, pause the video. That done? Okay. Found the machete. Now, I'm going to cut it out of the pot. If you're lucky, you don't have to do it. But today, I'm not lucky. Now, hopefully, it'll cook. There we go. So, now. Now I'm looking at this and it looks like it was in a bigger pot than it needed to be. But I'm not going to try and push it and put it in a smaller pot. I have some bonsai pots, but um, I could cut this off, but if you feel that, that's a solid right there. And if I cut into it, it would. Now this has to go, you want to make sure that you um, get enough wire so it'll go around the top and it can be wired. You can use it to wire. Do two of those. Watch your eye because okay. Now there's holes on the bottom that I drilled into the pot. So I'm going to pop those through. here and find them and you pull them up see mm -hmm. and then I'm going to do the same thing for, for the bottom part the very bottom part. If you look, look at under there, there's three holes for drainage. 
as well. Cool. And see how I pulled that screen, that metal, so it's tight on the bottom to get as much up in the. Now see. Uh huh. Okay. Now I'm gonna pull this dirt. it into the pot. Now. Okay. Now I have to get some sphagnum moss. Yep. Blankets in our hat grandpa. There's two kinds of sphagnum moss, at least two kinds. This is what a lot of people know as sphagnum moss, which is okay to put in. But this is a different kind of sphagnum moss, where it is a more organic, better for the... Now I'll cut that up. And I also need some bonsai soil. Oftentimes, this is lava rock, ground up lava. Let me see here. See it? Yeah. And then we'll pour a whole bag, because it's a big tree, in. Now, put a little bit more of this in. And I'm mixing it up. Now, I've got my rock. Mm. I'm going to put it up in here. Now see? Yep. See, it's pretty good to level to the top. So, I'm almost ready. See. Now you can tell that It needs a lot more soil because you really want it to be full. And I have a blue card around here somewhere, right by Albany. that raise bed soil. Now, I like this. It doesn't have any perlite. But it looks pretty much just like tree bark and things. So, I'm going to mix some of this in here, cut it up, and then Now it's important you tuck the wires down into the dirt after you cross them because you don't want them sticking up and hit somebody in the eye. 
and then you're going to top it off. Now, up the And then I'll go ahead and <clears throat> grab some more soil. And then soak in the soil it doesn't hurt to overfill it and back here behind is some is a spot where there is no soil Green fertilizer. Careful. And put the rock in. Some moss. Yes. And then I'll put it back behind here because the sun will shine the most right here. So that's it.